Yeah. Paddlefish in this stretch of the river are heavily parasitized by silver lampreys, and so almost every fish we, we every paddlefish we see has numerous fresh wounds, scars, and actual lampreys attached. I think our record is 11 or 12 on one fish. As young, lamprey are blind and toothless. They bury themselves into the sand. And there, at the river bottom, they lay in wait for up to seven years. come out, they're a changed fish. Their gill holes are fully formed. They can see, and they've grown a mean set of teeth, rings of them. They even have teeth on their tongues, so they can rasp into the flesh of their prey and suck blood. attached to a paddlefish, they suck out as much as they can. They rarely, if ever, kill the fish, but they leave terrible scars. These beady-eyed bloodsuckers attach to bodies, snouts, even up into gills. These are lamprey scars. You can even see the teeth marks on them. The lamprey are driven to the paddlefish by a need to feed. No beauty contest winners here. <laughs> 